July 28, 2022. This is session number 1133 of these communications coming through the Omega Communications Portal to you and to everyone who shares in the consciousness field that we connect with. My name is Lani and I open the Omega portal welcoming you into the space. And initially we connect in on the earth plane physically as if we have come into a big meeting room space. And then the energy that we are when we realize we are conscious beings of light and energy and information, this makes it easy for us to then step into the dimensional existence of the station of light, where again we assemble in an area often called the transition area. So stabilize yourself in this space and be ready to absorb the energy and information coming through to you. It feels like we've walked many different pathways, many different experiences to come into this point of existence. So from this point, where will we expand into? What will you choose? What will you tune into on this continuing journey? With these thoughts in mind, I step back and allow the galactic beings here to come forward to us. Aurum speaking to you, we welcome you into this space once more and in a continuous way as we progress together and as we move amongst you as you are gathered here and greet you as an individual. You may have experienced this throughout other dimensions and activities where you have experienced receiving a meeting or a greeting with a being who seemed to be not quite in the reality that other people exist in around you. And in fact, you may have been sensing us and receiving a galactic companion which nobody around you would perceive. This is the existence that you move into and will continue to experience. And you will also continue to experience an inner communication with you. We welcome you into this extra communication for you. And as you identify yourself as bringing in the appropriate energy field, around you and for you as an individual, then you have to acknowledge that you are doing that in a collective consciousness field. And that consciousness is the intelligent consciousness from the point of creation, not the diluted and distorted and a different assimilation of the process of absorbing the streams of consciousness. You will remember that there are many ways you connect into the stream of consciousness. We have introduced you to the pathways and the connections from your pure point of creation and existence. This is the spark of creative consciousness where you accepted and you chose to present yourself into 
different, significant elements and aspects of creation. That could be described as different evolutionary patterns in different patterns of creation, or in other words, different lifetimes in different civilizations, wherever they would be. Remember, it is the essential energy field, the essential energy consciousness of you that manifests in direct connection and accordance with the principles of life, the flowingness of life essence of what is required. So what is required in your existence currently? And is that why you have presented yourself into this session? So that you will receive the appropriate energy system to enable you to move freely in your existence and to be clearly connected with the streams of consciousness. We remind you again to be aware of the many galactic beings surrounding you. Remember, you are a galactic being and you simply have entered into this space so that you could continue revealing and performing the purpose and that you continue to bring in the activation processes and codes necessary in every way for enlivening the correct energy systems around Earth. They exist in that universal matrix of consciousness we've referred to in other sessions around you. So remember, the intelligent consciousness that you are, and if you perceive that as an energy field around you, an energy matrix with particular connecting points, the nodes that connect you into the greater overlaying matrix around planetoid Earth and around other beings and stations, then you see the importance of where you are and the importance of realizing these connections. You will have already stepped beyond limiting beliefs and the imposition upon many people. And so you have done the groundwork you have connected the higher field of conscious intelligence into you as the vessel, bringing it all into you in the ground. Uh, it is not to say that the physical ground, the patterns of earth and sand and water are deficient. They are sufficient because they are receiving the energy patterns quite naturally. So it means that you are bringing the higher consciousness field into the lower levels of energy frameworks and allowing the energy or the, the light and information to be present beyond distortions. In this way, you will be fulfilling your prime purpose of existence, which has always been to bring in this light field of consciousness expanding outward and throughout energy fields of creation in the evolutionary processes. In the phase that you are within, bring in the higher field conscious creations that you link in with. And you will see that those have no limitation. They are 
beyond even expression that may have not anything to do with the higher field of creation. You simply maintain your connection into the light field. We understand this is described to you as specific named dimensions. Now there is an overlaying escalation and expansion of dimensional fields which are simply consciousness fields. And there is the rippling effect that passes through all of dimensional fields of creation. In this way, and in this instance, we are referring to the streams of consciousness that ripple out through all of layers of dimension that might be described to you. Do not limit it in any way. You can freely choice choosing with your free choice where you want to place your point of existence. And you may step into fields of expanded consciousness to regenerate yourself. And always there is the natural regeneration process as part of the prime source code for all life that you tap into. So you could be connecting into this now, receiving the elements of creation necessary for you as you process what you engage in, in your activities around this world that you exist in. You may already be holding that clear energetic space around you in your energy field. And so you remain clear and strong, regardless of what is occurring around you, which other people may be talking about and focused on. So this again is a reminder to initiate the natural response in you that resonates with the higher energetic field of consciousness, naturally, the natural components of that. So, continuing also, you will be aware that there are natural elements around you that you can draw energy in from. Now this might be a plant, might be a mineral, it might be a mineral that you could extract from the earth known as um, a crystalline form. It might be the essence contained in the process of water infusion. You are collecting all of the energy fields of that. And these are components of your physical form. And again, you bring in the essential energy pattern into you. So there's a cohesion of what you perceive around you in the natural kingdom. The cohesive effect of that with the pure element, the pure codes of creation, the intelligent energy systems. And as you continue to do that, then you may perceive you are engaged more clearly with some of the other galactic presences 
and their purpose for being present as they assist you in your purpose for being present. And you share energy information systems. Just as you receive energy information systems through the centers of creative intelligence. And we call it intelligence because there is the natural process encoded in the flows of consciousness. And that will give you the idea presented of the specific order and processes. You are being refueled with all of this, re-energized throughout your in energy systems. You may also be aware that you are drawing upon information you might say it's coming into Earth. It is not actually as part of the current civilization on Earth. But whatever you draw upon from other galaxies has already been present because Earth is within a galaxy. There is the connectedness in creation. So you simply retain your conscious awareness within that evolving stream and process of the prime source codes for all. The focus is upon this because it shifts you and it shifts the earth simply in a process of the refinement and alignment processes into a higher coordination of the energy field. Enjoy this. And be aware now you are still or have returned to your awareness within the receiving area in this station. And so I withdraw now, Oram out. Again, Lani addressing you as a vehicle for all of this. And as you take this all into you, you may feel a rearrangement around you, a shifting of people's perception as they also connect into and receive because everybody basically has the prime source code already inherent within different aspects of every individual. It's just that you have chosen to align yourself into the essential elements of that prime source code. So this again is for us to bring back into the physical body form. Establishing yourself again as that centre 
of consciousness, pure energy systems. And this ends this session through the Omega Communications portal. So take in a natural breath and as you let it out, focus back within your body and in the, to the current Earth space time as we measure it. Enjoy who you are. Thank you.